What's up Raging Nation? How's it going? This is Alex Yu and in this video I want to take a little bit of a break from all that Transformers Age of Extinction movie news and all the talk about the upcoming Transformers toys and let's focus on another line of toys that's coming from another Michael Bay produced film and that would be Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Now we haven't seen any official looks and what the turtles are supposed to look like in the film or as a toy except from some leaked images that have been taken down from Paramount Pictures. Now they were actually exhibited at Toy Fair in 2014 last month uh, but uh, you weren't allowed to take any photos. However, I've been just looking around the net and suddenly I saw a link which brought me to the photos of all four turtles. Now, I'm not going to put them on the video, but I'll just tell you right now, you can find them at www.comicbookmovie.com. You can also find them at uh, collider.com, and you can also find them at actoys.net. So that's where you can look at them. So uh, why don't you scoot over there, take a look at them, and then I'm going to provide a commentary for them, all right? So first of all, you have a photo of every single one of them and I told myself before I saw these photos that if the turtles look good and the movie is decent then I might want to pick these toys up well my question is answered on whether or not I'm gonna pick them up because I don't want them at all anymore <laughs> based on these photos yeah I'm done uh, I'm gonna just I'm just gonna stay away from these guys. Let's just start off with this individual sh of the individual shot of these turtles. Let's start off with Raphael. And the first thing I notice is that he's got a really ugly face, <laughs> and his head is just so small. What's up with the small head? And uh, I'm just not liking the yeah everything above the neck. But everything else is okay. You know, all the other things, I, I don't mind the, the, the rags and the, 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 the bandages. I don't mind that. But maybe it's the fact that his the red, uh, you know, the eye band also covers his head as well. It just looks weird. It looks like a red hat of some sort. And his head is small and he's got that weird grunting face. So easy pass for me. Now let's take a look at Donatello. Donatello is a little bit different. Uh, he's he's got more gear on him. He's got the the uh, you know the, the the night vision goggles, and he's got this harness th that he's wearing, and he's got these um these samurai skirt uh, guards like it's type of, and it's a type of like uh, a light armor that he's wearing, which is colored gray. That looks okay. There's nothing really special about it. It looks okay. I don't have that many complaints, but it still um uh doesn't look like like really really great. Okay. He's got a lot of gear on his back, looks like a proton pack, but Donatello is always a kind of a inventor or scientist, so maybe the, all that gear has something to do with maybe some inven inventions that he makes in the movie, all right? Moving on, let's look at Donatello. Now, Donatello is using a, a different type of weapon uh, from, his nunchucks, nun from his nunchucks. He's using a... Um, like this is a like a different type of a, a martial arts weapon that's actually not a nunchuck. It's not even in the same family as the nunchuck. It's four, it's three, three rods that's held together by by chains. All right, and you use it like this, and you could also use it. Uh, uh, use you could use it on grabbing one one end and then uh, swing it around like a swinging pole. Anyways, uh, uh, what I don't like about Michelangelo. Angelo is that his face is kind of scary. I mean, he's got those big eyes and he's got a kind of got this weird grin where I don't know if he's he's screaming at you or if he's smiling. It just looks creepy. And his his he's wearing pants. Why is he wearing yoga pants? He's wearing black yoga pants and that makes no sense to me. And he's wearing, you know, this is, you know, the fact that he's wearing his hoodie around his waist, that's not bad, okay? That's kind of cool that adds personality, but still, um uh, the face, the face sculpt is weird, uh, and um, I don't like the fact that he's wearing black yoga pants. Okay, D uh, Leonardo looks the most decent out of all of them. Okay, he does have that s samurai bamboo armor at the front. Um, he's wearing a bit of a brown scarf, and he's also got these robes that covers his waist area. He looks the most decent out of all of them. In fact, I would actually pick up Leonardo if the other guys look just as good. But you know what? If you're going to 
buy Ninja Turtles, you're not going to just buy one of them. You got to buy all of them. And it looks like to me that one out of four is not good enough for me. So I'm just not going to pick them up at all. And um, I'm looking at the, the full shot of every single one of them. And I feel like it's all a contrast. They, they're all very contrasting. They don't look good as a team. They look like just a bunch of misfits. And Leonardo is the only one that looks normal and, and, and really true to... Uh... My light just burned out. And just true to his... His... Uh, his... His... his, his uh, you know, his, you know the way the character is supposed to look like. Anyways, if you want to check out what these guys look like, um, go to actoys.net or comicbookmovie.com or the collider uh, collider.com you can check out the, the the images there and check them out before Paramount Pictures takes them down again because apparently we're not supposed to see anything until 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 um, uh, uh, the trailer comes out the first trailer comes out uh, with Captain America the Winter Soldier so there you have it. That's all I got to say in this video. I just wanted to pro provide my commentary about the Ninja Turtles and how I feel about them. For me, it's an easy pass. And there you have it. That's all I got to say. As always, if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Like me on Facebook, The Raging Nation. Also follow me on Twitter, at Raging Nation. Check out my photos on Instagram. And I'll see you next time. Peace. Show photo release. So pretty cool. I'm really liking the way he looks. He has a battle mask. And then he can have his battle mask come off. And then he can shoot a gun out of